Peace, 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 y'all. Chocolate Amara, and this is part four. And the woman that's broken cannot be fixed. Now, I'm not here, once again, I'd say, like I said before, I'm not here to downgrade women or put them down. This is a conversation that we seem that we don't even really collaborate, we don't talk about. You know what I'm saying? Women might talk about it among themselves. Matter of fact, yeah, they might, because a lot of women don't talk about it. But I went through several different kind of women. I went to a woman that was a religion. I went to women in school. You be in school and still go to religion, but I just you're breaking out different brackets. Now you got that thought for female. And I call the thought female the one that just wow, her behavior's crazy. She has no authority. Figure she ain't listening to nobody but herself. That doesn't mean that she ain't educated. That doesn't mean she don't go to church. She just wow. I know a lot of thoughts that's in church. I know a lot of thoughts that go to school, love school, but they are thoughts. But listen here. If you think that thought is not smart, brothers, I'm telling you, don't get yourself caught up into this thing here. Don't do it to yourself. Don't do it to yourself. Females are geniuses. They are geniuses. Listen, I'm not trying to give them a higher archery. archery. No, I'm not doing it. I'm just telling you what I do know. From my own experience, from seeing, hearing, and being with women. They only allow you to act a certain way or put you in a certain bracket or allow you to basically rule them. Because if once a woman, a woman don't want you to rule them, it's done. It's done. That's why a lot of women winds up getting caught getting beaten. If the man frustrates and he can't control her, so the next thing you think the next thing you do is just pow. Then you got the other type that the woman be she's docile to the point that he gets he get turned on by that. So when he beat her ass and she accepts it, he starts beating her ass more. And he feel guilty. Listen to me now. Because see, when you over emotional on different dialogues like we have now, you're going to see it wrong. I'm telling you, you got some women who love being abused. And while they're being abused, they still manipulating you. <laughs> Listen, I'm not making this shit up. You probably know a few of them that's like that. They love being abused mentally. They love being abused physically. But they still controlling you. You're trying to figure that out. It's in your face and you don't even want to know it. You think a woman want to be abused? It's because psychologically she's been broken. And she's used to it. So if she get around this man and he's yelling at her, come on. What's wrong with you? I'm trying to work with you, it seems like, because she wants you to do that to her. Because in her mind, this is how he loves me, by being physical. You see? Listen, we can play these games all we want. That's why I'm throwing this, this science down to you. You call it where you want. But what I do know is this. When a woman is broken, she cannot be fixed. You can't fix her, you can't help her. But that doesn't mean you cannot fix her. But that does not mean that she don't know what she's doing. Because a woman can have five, six, seven, eight different personalities. 
and flip into these personalities when she's ready. Hear me now. Hear me now. You can never fix this woman. She can go to the doctors, psychiatrist, therapist. Huh? You can fuck this woman so good and she'll smack the shit out of you because she's smacking you because she's letting you know you better not fuck nobody else. <laughs> you understand it? So a lot of you dumbass motherfucking men don't know that. When you fuck that woman and she's crying and whatnot, and she looks at you and she pulls herself up and she's looking at you like, motherfucker, this shit belongs to me. And I will beat your ass. She ain't going to tell you. Verbally. But her actions going to speak louder than words. Sooner or later she'll start saying things like this here. You better not mess with nobody. No other woman. I cut it off. These are signs. These are signs that you turned her out to a degree. But she's still manipulating you. You can't fix her. You can't fix her. How you gonna fix a woman that's broken? How you gonna do that? You let her be. Let her be. Pay attention to me. Let her be exactly who she gonna be. But make sure your ass is far away from her. Cause she no good. Not for you. If you looking for a woman that you wanna work with and she can, she gonna be the bearing of you, hold your seed. I want you to hear me clearly now. You better not get no woman that's broken. Because if you make a baby with this broken woman, you in trouble. And the reason why I say this is because a lot of you men are still slow. That's why I'm speaking slow. I pick up speed if I want to. But a lot of you men are slow. See, when a woman is broken, but she hides it. The signs are going to be there. You can't, listen, you can't hide not the sign. It's like you know when it's going to rain. It gives you signals like what? Oh, it's going to rain. You can see the, the clouds turn gray, dark gray, almost a charcoal color. You feel this wind. Then these heavy drops start to come. Oh, depends. It can start off lightly. Oh, you know when it's going to rain. It's coming. Boom, boom. Now. There's always a sign. Are you going to try to catch the sign or, or recognize the sign or, or, or sit there and watch it? Because when they watch you, for all day, every day, to be, try to believe in you. You, men, that's what the fuck I'm talking about. Now, When you make a baby with this woman, she's going to go through all the process, the nine months process, whatever goes on physically, psychologically. You better watch her. And I know a lot of you, you're not trying to pay attention because a lot of you dumbass dudes, what you do while your woman's pregnant, you go out there and you start fucking other women. Other broken women. Or you can break that other woman who believes that you are hers because you ain't you telling her you ain't with nobody else. So let's 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 let's, let's don't forget this shit. You can meet a sweet woman. Sweet means she's respectful, honorable, caring woman. I'm not getting to the love because the love is in a whole nother level. But honorable woman. Her parents taught her, or oh, she's naturally like this. 
Don't get it twisted. There could be natural woman who's naturally loving, caring, understanding. But if you break them, whoo, you understand? And all sometimes it takes one dude, because that woman to put, I put everything into this dude. But what do you mean you put everything in it? You ain't even did a whole 30 years with the motherfucker. <laughs> Think about the psychological. Some women say, I put it all in them in one year. What the fuck did you put into this man? And all of a sudden you broke him. That means you was broken before you met him. Now I can see a woman been with a man for like 10 years and better. And then two, three years later he leaves your ass. Or you catch him in their own kinds of shit. And I could fuck a woman up. And break her. And when she broke it. When she come out. Out of that dungeon. She will not be the same. Now. I just threw that little bit at you. What I wanted to say is this. When you make that baby with this woman that's broken, you in a world of shit and you don't even know it. It's your child. And if it's a boy, mm, he looks like you. Mm. If it's a girl, mm, and you ain't doing what she said, she going to break the child down. Oh, yes, she will. She'll wait till that child start to talk. She'll wait till that child starts to understand. And then she'll begin to work on that child. And then a lot of you trying to figure out why is your child treating you kind of funny? Because the mother have already polluted their mind. I don't care how much good work you do. I don't care how much money you spend. I don't care how much time you spend with your children. That mother have corrupted that child because she broke it. And if you two ain't getting along, shit, you're going to have a lifetime contract. And the mother don't even have to be around you no more. She have corrupted that child so much that the child despises you. I didn't say hate you, despise you. Then the child learns to be deceitful towards the father. See, these are the things we don't want to talk about. These are the things that we seem not to want to chit-chat among each other. We want to talk about religion, and we want to talk about um, money, political. We want to talk about the police beating black people's ass and marching and all this shit. It's good, but you ain't talking about the, the daily basics, hardcore things that we deal with in our family life. You don't want to talk about that. I'm going to talk about that. Ancestors told me to talk about that. You choose not to talk about that because you're in hiding. You want to hide. A lot of you had a lot of problems when you was coming up. Brothers and sisters, kings and queens, gods and goddesses. You know, because some of you already walked that path. When your broken woman diluted your child. And you go, I can't stand the bitch. I can't stand him. Then you telling your child that you can't stand her mother or his mother. You don't even know you fucking up again. Because when you telling your child that, that child's like, excuse me, that's my mama. I'm just telling you. Tell me right now. You do not go that route. Let that mother, she going to get off on it anyways. But the more you go the opposite, the child will sooner, sooner or later will see the mother like, wait a minute, why are you talking about my father like that? That's not what he's saying. That's not how he acted. Trust me. But you engage into that warfare because that's what the broken woman wants you to do. 
She wants you to get into that meeting. Engage with her. She will let your child hang the streets. She'll let your child get away with murder in school. She'll let your child curse, carry on, have sex in the house, smoke weed. She'll let the child do whatever it wants so she can get you. This <laughs> is Yo, this is part four of a broken woman. You can't fix her. You can't fix her, and you won't be able to help her. Chocolate almond rye. I'm on. Oh, man. For the first, for anybody who watched this video for the first time, this is part four of a woman is broken. She can't be fixed. Um, gotta watch one, two, and three. I think it's a continuation. It's up to y'all. I put it out there because I don't really see too many people put those things out, and I really don't care. And I'm putting it out for myself and put this out for those who's listening. I am just, just the messenger, but we're coming up with part five. Peace, y'all.